Hey, welcome back to Best Music Live, where we have a passion for live music. Coming up in this week's edition, Madonna drops a new album, Soundgarden announces European summer tour, Justin Bieber releases a new single, Lollapalooza tickets on sale, Jonathan Antoine, our app on the Amazon store, DJ Polly D and more, right here on Best Music Live TV. Soundgarden announced earlier this week that they will be headlining the Hard Rock Calling Festival in London's Hyde Park. In addition, they also revealed that a number of summer dates across Europe. And for these dates, check out the article on bestmusiclive.com. Madonna's new album, NDNA, officially released Tuesday, that includes a regular 12-track release and a deluxe 17-track release available in either clean or explicit versions, with a bonus track on the pre-order and the Japanese version. So far, our favorite track is Falling Free. Look out for the full album review in the next few days on the site. Justin Bieber released his new single this week, titled Boyfriend, and it's very reminiscent of Justin Timberlake. It has quite the bass line and groove. Now, don't get it twisted. We don't have Bieber fever. However, we do have to give respect to the talent, determination, and hard work of the young man. Lollapalooza tickets went on sale this week, and a limited number of early bird three-day passes went for a measly 200 bucks. The festival is scheduled for August 3rd through 5th at Grant Park. However, the lineup won't officially be released until April 11th. The rumor mill is churning, and who may show up? At Lala Leaks on Twitter spewed acts like M83, Gautier, the, At The Drive-In, Garbage, Sleigh Bells, Corn, Skrillex only to be berated by one Perry Farrell, stating the lineup has yet to be finalized. We're thinking Radiohead, Foster the People, Young the Giant, maybe Black Keys. Whoever it is, it will sure to be a great lineup. Oh, by the way, happy birthday, Perry. Cheers. Who has seen this kid, Jonathan Antoine, from Britain's Got Talent? This guy just kills it. Before I had a chance to see him, somebody said he was like Susan Boyle. Not what you expect. He starts singing and melts the crowd. Keep an eye out for great things from this kid. His partner Charlotte puts it best, don't judge a book by its cover. Check out the post on Best Music Live's Facebook page or the video section on the website for the clip. Great news for Android peeps who like to shop on Amazon. Best Music Live app was submitted and is approved and now is live on the Amazon App Store for the low, low price of, you guessed it, free. Search for Best Music Live on Amazon.com. Twitter is a buzz with DJ Polly D. Honestly, never heard of him. Because to my credit, I've never watched one minute of Jersey Shore and apparently he's on that show. Credit to him for following his passion which happens to be playing and mixing music. His first single, Night of My Life, was released on iTunes today and if you are into the ha dance house mix type music it may be just up your alley. Not my alley. Additionally he has a spin-off show that premiered this week on MTV which should be renamed RTV for reality TV due to the lack of music. <coughs> Ahem. And lastly, Hee Jun Han was the latest American Idol finalist to be sent packing, receiving the lowest votes, and his effort to be saved by singing a song for you left him lacking the judge's good graces. Well, that should do it for this week's edition of BML TV. Follow us on Twitter at Best Music Live. Like us on Facebook.com slash Best Music Live. Subscribe to our channel up here. And download your flavor of the mobile app on iTunes, the Android market, and now on Amazon. Until next time, rock on.